Guys, how's it going? I am on a call today. I am uh, changing a motor on a flow center. Um, I gotta flush the loop. The loop has air in it. Also, the loop has a leak. So we are gonna put some loop conditioner in the system. Hopefully to stop that leak came highly recommended by water furnace. So this is the first time we've used this conditioner. So we will see how it pans out for us. All right, guys, I'll shoot some more videos. Have a good one. See you in a few. Okay, this motor's locked up. We're going to pull it out. See why it's locked up. And if we can't free it up and fix it, we will replace it. Okay. So what I've done is I've just opened the system to my flush cart. So I got the T's. So now I'm going to pull off the motor. Alright, so here's the old pump. It was actually seized up when I first tried to move it. So we're just going to go ahead and replace it. Um, the new pump comes with a new gasket. So yeah, we're just going to go ahead and replace it. So while we got it off, um, go ahead and flush this whole system. Thought I'd just go over how this works real quick. What inside of these um, geo flow centers look like. This is the pump, the um, propeller it sucks through this hole, gets sucked through here, and this flings it out around and down through that hole. There's a hole right there, right there. So it sucks in and it gets flinged down. Now the new pump did the um, high voltage wiring. About to put the new cap on and um, flush the system. I have the unit open to the geo unit now. And what I'll just go ahead and do this system is really low on fluids. And you know, I can just there. Now the loops are dead. I have no. Um, no uh, pressure in them. So I'm going to go ahead and fill up my cart. And I'll show you all the loop conditioner. So there's the loop conditioner. So what you do is I, I'll just fill up a bucket of water. And I'll um, add this to like a gallon of water. Like two gallons of water. And then I'll just dump this in my... Uh, flush cart with the with the diluted water with it diluted in water. There's a loop conditioner. Yeah, let's get to that. So adding the um, loop conditioner. Okay. So now what I'm gonna do so I'm gonna close off all of my ports. I guess I don't need to put something on. I'm going to start filling up on that handle moving. So now I'm filling up my flush cart. So I'll wait until it gets about here. Bleed my turn it on. Get ready to bleed my pump. So there, yeah, filling it up. Now we'll bleed the pump. <coughs> a lot of these actually have a little spinny do hickey on top. Ours doesn't. So just gotta loosen it like this, bleed it. And then we, once you get air, I'm gonna actually let it drain for a minute. Make sure you got all the air out of the system. Got my reservoir full. 
I'm going to go ahead and um, I got um, my pump bled. So I'm going to go ahead and turn on the pump. Go ahead and turn on the pump. And then the pump's on. So now I'm, this pump is basically sucking from the tank. It's going nowhere. So now I'm going to slowly open this valve just with my knee. Watch. See what happens here. There we go. Got some bubbles. There we go. We are now getting the air out of the system. There you go. Getting air in the system. That's what it looks like. And you have a whole lot of air in the system. So, as you can see, all kinds of junk in there. Lots of air. Lots of, they've had added a lot of water to this system. That's that wrap. Add a lot of water to this. <laughs> now I was just showing you the geo unit. I'll go ahead and uh, turn this. And as I'm turning it, I will show you what happens with the flush cart. There you go, my friends. Getting the air out of the system. Now I'll let this run for um, quite a while, and then I'll start doing my hammering. Make sure I got all the air out of the system. So we're done flowing. That's where I'm going to dump my excess fluids. So what I'm going to do here is pressurize the system. Make sure I'm going to turn so now I am sucking from the geo from the loop and I'm pressurizing into the loop get ready to turn that off okay so now I'm pressurizing in the loop okay so now I'm still flowing just gonna turn this off So now I'm going to pump this water into that bucket. <laughs> 